Hi, I'm Dr. Sharjeel and uh, a lot of uh, people were asking uh, me to say something about coronavirus outbreak uh, COVID-19. So I thought I should come with some info regarding uh, coronavirus. Now coronavirus, coronavirus uh, outbreak is uh, one of the burning health issue nowadays. So first of all, what does corona means? Well, corona means like a crown. Now, why it is called coronavirus? Because when you examine the coronavirus under the microscope, it looks like the whole virus is covered by pointed objects just like a crown. So that's why it is called coronavirus. Now there are many coronaviruses that infect the animals but there are three most famous coronaviruses that can infect humans. So the first one was in 2003 that is uh, SARS, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome. Then the next one was MERS, Middle East Respiratory Syndrome. And now the third one is uh, the ongoing outbreak of uh, COVID-19. The recent one is the less lethal, least lethal one, but the thing is that uh, it's the most contagious one so it has infected a lot more people than the MERS and the SARS now how did the COVID-19 spread to the humans well it uh, started in December 2019 and it is believed that uh, it started uh, in a Wuhan province of China and particularly in a seafood market people who ate uh, there they got pneumonia and uh, that pneumonia was later confirmed as COVID-19 in fact the first uh, doctor who diagnosed uh, this COVID-19 was an ophthalmologist uh, who was first sidelined that he is uh, spreading rivers uh, but then he was appreciated and uh, unfortunately he also got uh, coronavirus and he died uh, after a month <laughs> now what are the common symptoms well the incubation period is about uh, two weeks uh, and after uh, getting uh, after you, you get the uh, infection mostly through respiratory droplets uh, the symptoms start to appear within two weeks now what are the symptoms uh, the symptoms are uh, dry cough uh, fever flu like symptom conjunctivitis uh, fatigue shortness of breath and in severe cases severe uh, respiratory problems uh, kidney failure and death now how to protect from the coronavirus now that's a very important uh, so frequent hand washing is the most important uh, aspect of uh, prevention keep uh, washing your hands with soap and warm water and if the soap is not available uh, alcohol based uh, sanit hand sanitizers uh, can also be effective now the other thing is that to drink hot water because hot water uh, can also kill this uh, virus and decrease the viral load um, if you have got the flu like symptoms uh, just go to the doctor uh, isolate yourself from the community take rest uh, increase your immunity 
take as much as fluids uh, as possible uh, wear mask uh, eye goggles uh, and face mask are extremely important especially for the healthcare providers because the healthcare providers they are more prone to get uh, coronavirus as compared to the normal people because um, like we ophthalmologists uh, we are in a very close contact with the patient uh, we are in a very close contact to the mouth and nose and even eyes of the patients and we can get that patient can also get conjunctivitis one of the ocular symptoms or uh, ocular uh, sign also cover your coughs, cough and sneezes uh, with a tissue and then throw the tissue in the trash uh, avoid touching the avoid touching uh, eyes uh, avoid touching your eyes nose and mouth uh, with unwashed hands uh, avoid touching doorknobs uh, tables uh, chairs at your workplace um, clean and disinfect surfaces and objects uh, avoid overcrowded places um, the most uh, affected areas of the world are China, Iran, Japan, South Korea and Italy. So if uh, a patient who has got flu and who has uh, recent travel history to those areas, um, uh, they should also do the labs. Now some good news regarding coronavirus. Uh, the treatment is symptomatic uh, you have to give a lot of fluids uh, you should eat uh, fruits uh, vegetables uh, increase your immunity but the good uh, thing is that uh, this virus is temperature sensitive so as summer is coming uh, and this virus uh, is not able to survive uh, above 25 degrees centigrade so in summer hopefully we will be able to eradicate this virus <laughs> The other good thing is that uh, uh, if a virus, if this virus uh, infect uh, 100 people, so two people die out of 100, so 2 percent is the mortality. And uh, so the summer is coming uh, and it will be like drink hot water, uh, drink hot water. Uh, clean your face your hands again and again and uh, increase your immunity so that was all about the coronavirus you should know thank you very much